And my name's Catherine Aldred. I'm the Operations Manager at the Henry Moore Institute. I manage the building, um, so the maintenance, repair of the building. So I started on the day that the Institute opened on the 21st of April, 1993. As well as working here, I, I'm also an artist, so drawing a lot of buildings so today I'm drawing the Henry Moore Institute from the front hedgerow facade and also a bit of Cookridge Street as well, which is the other, one of the other facades of the Institute. Um, and drawing it in uh, well, pencil and watercolour and then there'll be a bit of ink, pen and ink to go over the top of that. I've started painting it the gable end in the rough um, sort of sandstone render because that's how the institute, the building was left in the 1920s, 30s. The original building was Victorian wool merchants offices. And then in April 93 when the institute opened, the architects, Jeremy Dixon and Edward Jones, um, reorientated the, the, the entrance of this new purpose-built sculpture gallery um, by creating a new entrance on the hedgerow, on this gable end. So when the Institute was being designed, the uh, Leeds City Council were keen for the, for the hedgerow facade to match Leeds City Art Gallery, so for that to be sandstone. and. When the idea of granite was first raised, um, they suggested using a red granite. I think at that time there, were, there was a, a fashion for using a lot of red brick um, around Leeds mm -hmm. and the foundation and first director, Robert Hopper, I think were keen for, to get away from that look and to have something uh, more sculptural and more monolithic and minimal. Um, so. The architects preferred the Italian granite, uh, a black, very dark green in fact, but black looking granite called Uber Tuba, um, which they thought would have uh, a much more dramatic impact. The architects, architects deliberately left some of the re original rendered gable end visible, so you can see that the original, the original end of the building um, so that the granite is, is kind of attached to that. Sure, <laughs> Here we go.